All right, I call this the flagpole problem. Okay, and I over-exaggerated it quite a bit because the flag isn't this long, but still. Uh, the flagpole problem exists because once in a while we want to add fabric to a thing, okay? But we don't want it as fabric. We want it as a model to look like fabric. So in order to do that, um, we have N-Dynamics, okay? N-Dynamics is newly added to the series of Maya. Not two I think it came in at 2009-2010, um, but, you know, it's one of those things that, you know, it takes a while to get popular I would say so here we have this and I'm going to take and create an end cloth out of it let's go into square box see if there's anything special in here that I should show you nope create cloth all right so what's gonna happen here is if you hit play it's gonna fall it's just going to fall forever. So now we have to kind of look at how do we weld this to a certain orient. And under here, we have passive colliders. We can go here and say component component. Uh, I'm having a hard time reading these because I have the three letter extension things and I remember them saying what they actually are. So that's why it's taking me a second. All right, I think it's component to component, okay? So what we're gonna do here is take and zoom in right in this area. I'm gonna go into vertices. And this one I'm going to go into vertex. And I'm going to grab a vertex here and going to grab a vertex here. Now, sometimes it's easier to grab them using the selection tool. And let's go in here, component to component. Good. Now, it's going to be hard to do this down here. So what I'm going to do is insert an edge loop. right about here and grab the vertice here and grab the vertice here and again go into end dynamics component to component all right so let's hit play Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Now, the pole. Well, the pole should be in the way of the object. So, if you go in here, create passive collider. So now, when it does fold, it will go around the object. And that is a very hard thing to model. Something that drapes around an item like that. Now keep in mind that works for everything, not just flags. But flags is the worst case scenario because you know you have to have that extra component in there to constrain it to the flagpole. But you could you could uh, extrapolate from that and create you know like tablecloths, um, shirts, capes, everything else for that matter. So, and you can add other objects into the mix where, you know, certain objects fall onto other objects like this, for example, where I would have another passive collider and hit play. So now I'm getting that draped fabric. Again, another thing, really hard thing to model. Um, and there it is. When you're done, you know, with all dynamics, you can just duplicate it over and there we go I have my model done. alright so that is the flagpole problem and enjoy move on to the next video